What's up, guys? I want to show you a, a do or kind of do a review and explain. Uh, well, not explain the trick, but do a review on it. This is called uh, Fold Fold Again. Some of you might know it. Some of you might not. But this is one of the. It's a pretty you know overlooked piece of magic. I got it on eBay for I think like uh, ten bucks, maybe less. And I went out today and bought bulldog clips. And these are that's what these are called is bulldog clips. And you can get them at Walmart. And I bought a multicolored, multi-size pack one for like four bucks or something. But it comes in handy because this is like a prediction thing at the end. I'm gonna try to perform it for you on camera here, and then I'll uh, you know go over it a little bit more. It's gonna take me a second to get it ready. So this is a secret preparation that I'm doing right now. Now you're the audience, and obviously you don't know about this. <laughs> That goes there. Okay, now. Let me see here. Okay, so there we go. Sorry, I know it's taking long and videos that people don't want to watch. It's probably somebody setting up a magic trick, so to speak. But it'll be worth it, I promise. Okay, so I am set. I have a three cards. I have the five of diamonds, ace of spades, and the eight of hearts. So you show these front and back, so you can see the backs. So ace of spades is obviously in the middle, and then the back cards. Then you square them up like this. Then you take a handkerchief, which is an 18-inch silk. I got this from Hiram, the Haunted Hanky Magic Trick, and I took out the gimmick just to use it for this because it works. And silks are not going to be enough to cover it because of the lighting. The, the, the audience is going to be able to see right through, but not with this because it has a pattern. And it's 100% polyester, and it's a little thicker. So then, after showing the three cards, the eight of hearts, the ace of spades, and the five of diamonds, you cover them like this. And then you tell your audience you're going to remove one card. So you do. You remove one card, and that is the eight of hearts. And you put that aside. So let me just drop that right there. And then you go back to this, and you tell them you're going to remove one more card. And that card is the five of diamonds. So you then show that front and back and toss that aside. So if that was the eight of hearts with the five of diamonds, obviously that leaves the ace of spades. This is where the audience gets really confused when you open it up and it says fold. Note that there's nothing, there really is nothing in the handkerchief, so I'll just kind of shake that around. And then they tell you, and I, you can, this can be done for kids or adults. I'm using it for adults as my closer because I'm going to say things like, and don't take my lines, but some of you were fooled. Some of you were fooled again. And then you toss it aside. And then you pick up the envelope which has your bulldog clip on it that was hanging in full view the entire time before you even started this performance. You take off the bulldog clip, throw that aside, open up the uh, envelope, pull out a card, show the envelope empty, which it is, and then you can do the reveal however you like. Ace of spades. And that's the fold and fold again effect. It's a great effect. I love it. I'm going to use it for my closer because, like I said in my line, some of you applauded, some of you didn't, some of you laughed, and some of you smiled. But in the end, you were all fooled and fooled again. And that's kind of like my closer concept. It's still kind of in the works a little bit, but that's about the, the idea behind it. So this trick again is called Fold, Fold Again. You can get it on eBay for around 10 bucks. Um, now the card is not going to come with this painted on here. I painted this on here because I'm a magic geek and I like to doll up my effects and I'm a little bit of a nerd and kind of weird when it comes to that. So there you go. That is Fold and Fold Again. Peace. Hope you like it. Leave leave, uh, oh yeah, leave comments, questions, and uh, things like that. So if you got any questions, I'll be happy to answer them. And please smash that subscribe button. I'm going to do the latest and greatest reviews. 
as fast as I can. It depends on the mail with COVID. So we'll see. Anyway, holler. Bye.